November 6, 2019, Wednesday of the 31st week in Ordinary Time. A reading from the letter of St. Paul to the Romans. Brothers and sisters, owe nothing to anyone except to love one another. For the one who loves another has fulfilled the law. The commandments, you shall not commit adultery, you shall not kill, you shall not steal, you shall not covet, and whatever other commandment there may be, are summed up in this saying, namely, you shall love your neighbor as yourself. Love does no evil to the neighbor, hence love is the fulfillment of the law. The Word of the Lord. The Responsorial Psalm The response is, Bless the man who is gracious and lends to those in need. Bless the man who fears the Lord, who greatly delights in his commands. His posterity shall be mighty upon the earth. The upright generation shall be blessed. Bless the man who is gracious and lends to those in need. He dawns through the darkness, a light for the upright. He is gracious and merciful and just. Well for the man who is gracious and lends, who conducts his affairs with justice. Bless the man who is gracious and lends to those in need. Lavishly he gives to the poor. His generosity shall endure forever. His horn shall be exalted in glory. Bless the man who is gracious and lends to those in need. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Luke. Great crowds were traveling with Jesus, and he turned and addressed them. If anyone comes to me without hating his father and mother, wife and children, brothers and sisters, and even his own life, he cannot be my disciple. Whoever does not carry his own cross and come after me cannot be my disciple. Which of you, wishing to construct a tower, does not first sit down and calculate the cost to see if there is enough for its completion? Otherwise, after laying the foundation and finding himself unable to finish the work, the onlookers should laugh at him and say, This one began to build, but did not have the resources to finish. Or what king, marching into battle, would not first sit down and decide whether with 10,000 troops he can successfully oppose another king advancing upon him with 20,000 troops? But if not, while he is still far away, he will send a delegation to ask for peace terms. In the same way, every one of you who does not renounce all his possessions cannot be my disciple. The Gospel of the Lord.